Hi Virgo. This is your weekly three cards tarot readings by M for the week starting 27th of April 2000, oh, 2020. Okay, three cards. Main energy cause and effect. Just that quickly. For more details, we'll go later with the day by days. Okay, main. The world. Cause of it is Eight of Swords. An effect is Seven of Swords. Influencing energy, the Chariot. Chariot. We love this energy of Chariot when you so clearly what is on your way. Um, not what is on your way, what is your goal, what, what is that you need to achieve at this point. You know exactly here. It's influencing energy, that's what you knew. You see, you know exactly how to do that. That's the chariot. You're keen to do it kind of quickly. Um, this chariot has a kind of speed um, always with this. Whatever decision, movement, um, you can move relocate with this one uh, lots of driving involved as well with the chariot this movement speed also um, involved in here but as I said you've got your goal in front of you and you would like to get there um, like uh, as soon as possible and you don't see obstacles in here like that kind of energy so no need to delay and that kind of stuff. When you see, yeah, I've got it, I can do it, you don't see reason for delays and everything. Um, um, nothing can stop you and that sort of things. Now being this Ace of Swords, it seems something got on your way. Death. World and death. So much, so much of completion and transformation happens in here. And then Seven of Swords, Seven of Swords, we have it twice in here. Okay, and Seven of Swords will again, world. Queen of Pentacles, that's your energy, eh, Virgo? Very nice, very nice. You being in your own power, often you get your energy in your readings, Virgo, and I like it. It seems that you are confident lately. Whatever is happening in your life, you've got this confidence that you are dealing with situation. There's no fear. You know, you've got clear goals and stuff. You are confident to you understand your world. You understand yourself, that kind of moment that you have. It seems to me lately, kind of, even maybe last couple of months, that I often, often see these sort of energies with you. How's my card standing? Skew, of course. <laughs> oh, right. Anyway, um, now your main energy, the world, and the death. That's very major. That's very major completion. But let me first talk about cause energy now. I would like to connect this chariot, Queen of Pentacles, with Ace of Swords and Seven of Swords. Look, you find yourself, it seems to me like you find yourself in the situation when something suddenly uh, stood on your way. Everything that you had, as I said, clear and you are very confident and in your own power, some, something suddenly was there and um, unavoidable, eight of swords. You know, it's it's uh, it's un it was unavoidable. You just got yourself stuck in a situation that um, it just happened to you. You know, um, maybe it's all of these restrictions that we um, that we have right now from authorities. We have that everywhere in the world, wherever you are. You've got sort of re restrictions that come from authorities, you can do that, you cannot do that, and it affects you in a way that your goal, whatever you had in your mind that you're supposed to finish, you cannot do it right now. You cannot. You 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 were stuck somehow there. Seven of Swords tells me, like you're trying to wiggle out <laughs> of this situation, kind of not to confront the situation, but just to get out of it. Not to argue uh, on the 
but you know you're trying to get to use this back door <laughs> you know kind of in a tricky way somehow no arguments but you're still getting out of a situation that is really sticky there for you that kind of cause energy that you have that sort of energy you had to finish with that the world and the debt energy to me comes just because of that because of ace of swords and seven of swords you couldn't manage to wiggle out of this situation just you know no confrontation i found the back door nobody knows that i was even in this difficult situation i'm just carrying on with my own things no you are not you have to kind of um, close down maybe even whatever that was your goal in here whatever that success or, or winning situation that you saw for yourself perhaps perhaps is that you have to transform you have to finish you have to complete suddenly abruptly you have to complete something the, look the world is a, a successful completion all right we always talk about it but then the, the death underneath says it is transforming. With the world, it is the successful completion and on that one, we starting something new. We can build on that. You know, it's a solid ground, that situation, that completion. It's a solid ground to move on with the similar or with that to a bigger uh, a, a plateau, a bigger picture of the same. You know, or something else that is related to that what we completed. But it's always seeds for new things that comes. The world, it's not just a completion, it's not finished, but it's seeds for something else. Now the death underneath, it says, it is uh, uh, something completely different. You have to transform your goals. That what you had on your mind, you have to transform. Like um, you had in your mind, you've got clear what you're going to do. You you do you were very confident about what what you wanted for yourself. The situation came that you know it turned this this these things upside down. It, it tied your your hands and in and, and your legs and you couldn't move. You couldn't move. That was situation that completely cancelled this optimism, this solidity, this uh, uh, goal in front of you. But now it is completion, but it is successful and transforming into something else. This, uh, it, it isn't bad. This is good. I mean, it doesn't matter. Uh, it's not what you, what you planned what you wanted it was very clear you were very happy very it said, it said this situation that you wanted that you had for yourself was really good but what i'm saying this interruption that changes completely situation will work for you eventually it will work it will change but it won't change for bad it will change the world and the death card it will just transform into something else it's not gonna kind of uh, um dissipate and, and you lost your opportunities and whatever your winning situation did have uh, you had in your mind that you can achieve something that it kind of it's never going to happen no not in that way not it will happen in a different way your achievement will be something else or it will be um it, it will come in a different way in a different time different i don't know environment something i hope you understand me it's it's transforming it's just changing not exactly what you planned but it's still good it's nothing bad is happening this week though it, the cause energy of it it's oh it's frustrating this is both of these seven of swords e and eight of swords you don't know which one is worse feeling as a seven of swords trying to find a way of the situation and not arguing not getting into it not confronting it you know not confront and, and still feeling stuck in the moment i think this week is coming you might feel that you are kind of under pressure you all stuck in there you know how can i how else i can put it it's a majors these are two very very majors 
and he's talking about completion, but in a successful way. But trans and, and transforming the death is that within you. I don't think you're going to feel uh, um, any sort of frustration if it's happened, if this happened in a different way. You will want it. You will even uh, um, support it. You will feel it that you are transforming this situation into something else like that will be your way of because we do have this seven of, of uh, uh, swords here as well that's your way how to deal with situation that you kind of you you know about what i'm saying you're trying to wiggle out of the situation yeah maybe is that what you're gonna do you are completing and transforming your ideas you yourself it could be that it's not that's coming from uh, um outer sources or influences it is what you want you are influencing okay i cannot get out of this sticky situation i cannot do that what exactly i wanted but i can complete that and transform into something else the world again in here you see what i'm saying you yourself you are transforming uh, um working out this situation so um you are not stuck anymore and uh, um, you're not confronting it. You are not arguing. There's not clash of interest in here. There's not clash. It's a world is successful completion for all, all involved. That you are uh, one who's um, um, driving it. You are completing it and you transforming it the way you want it for yourself. That's what I'm saying, this Seven of Swords is. That's your way how to wiggle or how to deal with situation, to still get your success. You see, you still get your success, uh, no matter um, this outer unpleasant situation that came, um, 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 that influenced you suddenly that influence you. Um, I think this was unexpected from your, from your environment. This is your environment, uh, Eight of Swords. But you are managing and you do have the world card. You are doing it. You are doing You're changing it. Um, your goal, you're just changing your goal. All right? I'm, I'm completing this what uh, situation, whatever I can, and transforming into something else which suits me well as well. <laughs> It's all right for me, this another way, you know, this or that way, you know, it's either way, you good with it. I don't know what will be the situation, if it's business, it doesn't matter, were you at this position or on another, it suits you well. Uh, uh, working from home or working in the office suits you well. That, that sort of things, you see what I'm saying? But you are one who is uh, instigating, who's suggesting, who's closing, who's busy there uh, um, with the with the um, transforming the whole the whole energy, the whole situation there. You will be successful, nonetheless. You will finish. You will find just a different way. It's just in a different way. Maybe with different people um, in a different place. You are there to do that. You are doing it. And feels like Seven of Swords, like you're doing it like a sneaky lick. <laughs> Which is not. I mean, you've got beautiful success in here. And uh, uh, this isn't sneaky energy in this uh, uh, occasion. You are right not to want it confrontation. You just, you don't want confrontation and you want and you find your right way to transform it. So it's good. You know, for you will be a rat, it was. Interesting, eh? I hope you enjoyed it, Virgo.